my f all right welcome back to the channel today we're going to be watching game of thrones season eight episode three now the last episode ended with the night king pulling up to winterfell he is here he's like he's like a hundred yards in front of winterfell at, at this right now and yeah i expect things to go down they were prepping for it in the last episode and actually in the last episode it was actually a pretty wholesome episode you know like nobody died which is pretty shocking ever it was just characters interacting with each other which was pretty nice to see to be honest because we got a lot of good interactions a lot of good character moments in that episode but we got one very interesting interaction in the very end which ah uh, it seems kind of weird okay it was John telling Danny like who his parents are and stuff, and now, and then the Night King pull up like right then and there. So it's like okay, they don't really have they don't have time to talk about it more. But okay, I'm gonna be honest, I don't really like the timing of when John told her. Like John knows that Night King's going to be here at any given moment. He knows it's coming. So why would he tell her this right now? Like this makes no sense. Like it's gonna it's a huge distraction for what's about to happen so like why would he tell her this now like i'm not mad that he's telling her in general i'm mad that i'm just like annoyed by the timing of it like dog think about it like this is the super bowl okay if this were the super bowl you want all of your players to be in the mo in the in a perfect mindset you want no distractions you want nothing to possibly distract him, right? Coach told him like, yo, you're gonna be on a new team the next year or whatever, right? But they're about to go play the Super Bowl. That's gonna fuck with the quarterback's head. Like, like, do I really wanna win the Super Bowl for this team now? Like, I wanna win it, but do I wanna win it for them? I don't know, that might not be like the best analogy, but <laughs> whatever, you, you know what I mean? Like, that's gonna be in your head now. You're like, wait, what? The point I'm trying to make is like, the timing of this information is very bad. I don't know, hopefully Daenerys doesn't think fucking twice about saving Jon or someone in Winterfell now, like Sansa or something. Like, if I'm her, I'm thinking twice now about saving anyone from Winterfell, you know? I expect characters to die in this episode. I'm ready for it, so... Also, I was told that this episode does get pretty dark and it's pretty hard to see in some scenes. So if I have trouble seeing, I'm just going to turn this light off. That's right here. Oh, and also I'm going to try a different editing format for this video because normally I just have so it's basically this exact frame with the show slash the show or the film, whatever we're watching right here with this can is. I like it, but I kind of want to try something different. So I'm going to try and edit, I'm going to edit this video a little bit differently. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you like it, if we should keep it or go back to the old way we've been doing it. If it's shit and you don't like it, please let me know. Don't be afraid to let me know. So, or if you have, or if like you like it, but you think it could be a little bit better if I did this instead of this, you know, like whatever, please let me know down below in the comments. But anyways, I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're just gonna hop right into this episode. If you'd like to watch the full length reaction, that will be available on Patreon as an early access to the next three episodes of Game of Thrones will also be available on Patreon. So let's get started. No, the dragon. Oh, that's our dragon, that's our dragon. Okay, okay, that's our dragons. <laughs> Thought that was the Night King's dragon. Oh my god, we have so many on- oh my god. Okay, yeah, I can't see shit. I mean, I can see, but it's kind of hard. Oh, I Vod's in the front with Big B. It's Jamie, yep, Jamie's in the front too. Okay, honestly, I do think the Hound will probably- will die right here. Ed's probably gonna die. Sam's not gonna die. Jorah? Jorah might, actually. Yeah, Jorah's probably gonna die, dude. They on screen? I can't. Okay. Arya and Sansa will live, I think. Grey Worm's probably gonna die, too. Oh, God. Who is this? Oh, wait. Is that Melisandre? No fucking. No way. No shot. <gasps> the, bro, are you cool with the Night King or something? Like, why are you coming from that direction? <laughs> Do you speak their tongue? Tell them to lift their sword. Why? Because they're right behind you or something? Viva Noah Rak Shafti. 
She's giving us like a good luck charm or something. Zobria Issa says signal to Ledus. Oh, let's go. That's lit. Dude, she does have powers then. It's not okay. Oh, I can see way better now. <laughs> But the sword that Sam gave him, that's, I love that actually, because Jorah brought this honor to his family, so he didn't, so John got his sword he's supposed to get, you know, but then Sam gave him his sword. I love that. Oh, Sir Devos, Caesar. He's gonna go press her sword. Oh, he looks pissed. I'll be dead before the dawn. Hmm. All right, no confidence in yourself. Or was it part of like your prophecy that you'll die? Lord of Light tell you that you're gonna die. Oh, are you? Oh, the other right you're going. Okay. Also, I have a correction. There us. Uh, I was told on Patreon that we only have about twenty to thirty thousand Darthraki. The rest didn't couldn't make the trip, which makes sense. Okay. So I'm not as confident as I once was, but. Then again, it doesn't matter how many we have, because once we start dying, they're just gonna turn them more whites. So it's a timing game to get to the Night King before you know too many of us die. Regardless, doesn't matter how many we have. All oh, the music too. Oh, that's fucking sick. That's so lit. It's like the, it's literally like the theme music in the intro. Dude, oh dude, when the Darth Raki start dying and they turn into the lights, we're gonna be so fucked. Oh, I love how the dire walls right here. Watch them not even Oh there they are. Okay, that's what I said. <gasps> oh. oh my god. Oh my god. It's a little oh. oh Danny is so nervous. Oh no, we're gonna slowly see all the lights go out. And we're gonna slowly stop hearing them. They're gonna get quieter and quieter. Oh no. Did they really just wax them all that easy? <gasps> okay. Yeah, they retreated. The Night King is coming. The dead are already here. Wait, yeah. Okay, wait, why don't you just. Khaleesi, why don't you just have your dragons fly over top of them while they're that far back and then just burn the entire army? Like, what are we doing? Like, as they're lined up right now, just have your dragons fly over and burn them right now while there's still a gap between us and them and while they're all lined up perfectly for... Like, what? Like, do you know what I mean? <laughs> I mean, we got a lot of Unsullied, though, too. Not a lot of them. I read a comment. It's like, this is perfect for them. This is what they're made to do. This is what they're bred for. This type of battle. Like, in the city of Marine, they were kind of mid. Because it's not how they're that's not how they were trained to fight. This is how they were trained to fight. Oh my god, that is Oh my god, that looks oh so much is happening. Oh dude, they're literally it's literally just like a wave of them. Oh my god. Oh. <gasps> no, 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 no. No. Thank oh thanks Khaleesi, thanks. You couldn't have fucking done this when we are all we are all mixed together with them? Like alright. Like do you know how many of us are gonna kill by accident? Uh whatever, alright. I mean it's still sick as hell to see this. Oh my god. Oh yes, yes, get him. No, no, do not, do not, do not, dude. This fool has a missile on his arm, alright? Oh no. Oh, there's a storm? Oh yeah, this is kind of a problem. I don't know how to use it. <laughs> Figure it out. Sticking with the pointy end. Oh, I was just about to fucking say that! I swear to god, I was just about to say that. As I was saying, figure it out, I literally thought of my head pointy end. And so I was gonna say stick him, but then she just said it. <laughs> Big V, okay, she's, oh. I mean, honestly, Big B and Jamie would rather die a knight's death. So, a knight's death. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, 
Oh, thank God. Sharp, get up! I love Ed. <gasps> no! Oh my fucking god. Hey! He was, he's the first. <laughs> okay, whoever killed Ed, was that someone we were supposed to know? Because it kind of looked like the wilding from Hard Home, like the girl, you know? That was like, who was like, children kill, got killed or something? I don't know. Hey, we're fucked out there. We're gonna die. I give us 20 minutes. That's what I would say if I was Sansa. <laughs> yeah, just get drunk. R.I.P. Ed, though. R.I.P. Ed. <sighs> Go back! Go back! Oh, I, I really hope Lady Mormont doesn't fucking die. I really hope she doesn't. Stay on your ground. Oh. <laughs> I love the aerial shots, though, that they're giving us. It really puts it in, <laughs> into perspective. <laughs> Ooh. Save the hound. Love to see it. Grab our nose. Yeah, I'll li they light that shit. Dude, is he, is he scared? Very room looks, I'm not like scared, but he looks nervous. Like he's becoming more human, I guess, than, le than unsullied. Maybe like him falling in love kind of makes him more human, you know? It's not gonna work. Like Grey Room's developed more emotions than the most unsullied. Yeah, he looks like he looks like he's scared right here. It seems like since Grey Room's fallen in love, he's developed like he's developed actual human emotions. So he now has like fearful. Watch her just watch her just turn into like a dragon. <laughs> That'd be the most random shit. <laughs> oh, she's gonna light on. Okay, yeah, she's gonna light the trench. That's all right. Come on! I'll just put like a letter. <laughs> Come on. Yes. She came through. Oh, oh it's so late. Literally. <laughs> Oh, the fire in her eyes right there. Yeah, they just stop, bro. <laughs> I mean, it'll buy us some time, but... <gasps> no, what, what's clear? Yeah, he can't be right there. He can't stay. No, bro. Something that makes a difference. Remember the Battle of Blackwater? I brought us through the mud gate. And got your yeah. face cut in half. Yeah, and then your dad saved everyone. If I was out there right now... You'd die. Yeah. Like, there's literally no army that can come in and save us right now, because the Battle of Blackwater, Tywin came through and saved them. The Battle of the Bastards, it was the Veil vale and Peter Baelish. Oh, wait, you fucking killed him. And, I mean, it's not like the Veil vale could even do anything. <laughs> Pretty sure they're already here, too. But it doesn't matter even if they were to pull up, it would not make a difference. We should have stayed married. You were the best of them. It wouldn't work between us. Why not? The Dragon Queen. Your divided loyalties would become a problem. That already has. Without the Dragon Queen, there'd be no problem at all. We'd all be dead already. Yeah. She doesn't. She doesn't like. She does not like Sansa talking bad about her queen. You know that she should. Dude, imagine if Ramsay won the Battle of the Bastards, and then just out of nowhere, the Night King just pulls up on him. <laughs> I just want you to know the things I did. Everything you did brought you where you are now, where you belong. Mm hmm Right here in this moment. Home. Oh yes. I'm going to go now. Okay. Take care. Safe travel. Go where? <laughs> He's gonna war get some. Check on him. Check on the Night King. Yep. Ooh. Oh. I'm just gonna send them to throw the. The trenches, all right. 
yeah, eventually enough bodies will just put out the fire. Or make a path to walk over. We have so many of them, it doesn't matter. Like, the Night King can spare a couple bodies. It should have made the trench a lot bigger, to be honest. You should have made them like 10 feet deep, honestly, too. But that would probably, that would have taken way too long to build. Or the dig, I mean. Actually, maybe not with as many people as we have, though. I don't know. I don't know. Uh. Is, is that the dead dragon? Uh, not the night? Yep, yeah, it is. Uh, uh. <laughs> like that. <laughs> no! Oh, Big V's, Big V's coming. She's coming, Jamie. Yes. <gasps> oh, he has Beric. Yeah, the hound is. The hound's literally shaking. The hound's literally having a panic attack from all the fire. Ooh, Arya, yeah. Lady <laughs> Mormont. Dude, do not kill her. Do not kill her. Fuck off, dude. That is not. No. Are you kidding me? Ooh, ooh, oh, Arya would be dead after that. I'm sorry. Her skull would have cracked after that. Again, we need you. Yeah. You can't give up on us. Fuck off. We can't beat them. No. Oh, you see that, you stupid whore. We're fighting death. I can't beat death. Uh, he's lost all hope. He's broken. Tell her that. Yeah, tell her that. She, Arya is still trying as hard as she possibly can. Oh, he's gonna... <gasps> no, 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 Lady Mormont. Oh, no. Don't, you're just gonna squish her, huh? It's thumb in the chat. Uh, yep. I'm gonna bite her right off. Oh, oh, good shit. Good shit, good fucking, good shit. Oh, God. Ah, oh, I don't know she, she's dead. I thought it was just about to bite her fucking head off. <sighs> R.I.P. Lady Mormont. <laughs> R.I.P. Hey, she took out a giant. The, the smallest person here took out the biggest. I love that. Oh, oh no, they didn't hear that. <gasps> Mm. Oh, oh, sorry. <gasps> oh, my. Oh, good shit, Arya. Do you know how fast of a reaction she would have? She has to have to, like, look, realize it's the white, and then just go like that? Because, like, what if that was just, like, what if that was another person, and, you know, you just kill him by accident? Wow, that would be so scary to be in the crypt right now, just hearing all that. Hey, she's gonna protect us. She said she'll protect all of us down here. There's nothing we can do about it. You open that door, they're all coming in here. They'll break it down eventually, but... He's coming to save Aria. Dude, imagine if the hound dies by burning to death. That would be I just, that would be the worst way for him to die. Oh, where's the fucking throw, Eric? Oh, it, no! Come on! No! Oh, this is Beric's death. Oh yeah. Thank you, Beric. Thank you. Damn. The Lord brought him back for a purpose. Yep, to save Arya. No, that purpose has been served. 
Oh, is Arya special? Melisandre sees it or something? I know you. I know I know you. You said we'd meet again. And here we are, at the end of the world. You said I'd shut many eyes forever. Brown eyes. Mm. Green eyes. Blue eyes. And blue eyyes. Mm -hmm. She killed who she said who she, who she said she was gonna kill. Not everyone, but a good amount. But what does Aurora Light want to do? It yeah, want with Arya. Oh! 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 I knew that fucking hurt. I know that hurt. Oh, this the Ice King's is gonna. Then the Night King, I mean the Night King, he's just gonna get him. I see that spear in his hand. Oh shit, oh shit, get wow, get knocked! He's not gonna die from that ball, but he's just, oh. Dude, that must hurt for Danny, dude. Having to kill like her own dragon pretty much. Oh and then oh John. I don't know how I yeah, I don't know how you don't have a broken back from that fall, but... <laughs> can throw... Dracarys. Oh, that's not gonna work. Oh. Oh. Like, I know fire's their weakness, but like, I feel like some shit... I feel like some bullshit is gonna happen. Yeah, he's fine. How is he... How is he immune to fire? I mean, like, I don't know. He knows it's a weakness. And, oh, no, 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 no. Yes. Oh, he missed. Okay. Bro, this fool has a fucking Aaron Rodgers arm, dude. <laughs> um, I mean, he must have, like, he done some shit, casted a spell on himself. I don't know. All right, John, run off on him. Run off on him now. He knows John's behind him. He has to know. He's not stupid. Oh, that was a thumbnail. <laughs> no, right there is that. That's it. Fuck off. Don't do this shit. Don't don't look at me like that. He's going to raise everyone from the dead right here. Because that's what he did at hard home. John has to kill him before everyone wakes up. Yep. Before everyone gets up, John has to kill him. Yeah, see, everyone that was on our side that just died is now on his team. Yeah. Now we gotta do this shit all over again, and Jamie's realizing. Bruh. <gasps> Lady Mormont. <sighs> no, the Dorothy. Ed. No. Okay, all the other White Walkers are right here. We have to wipe them all out to kill. To so all the other Whites shut down. I don't know how we're gonna do that. I really don't. Because <laughs> apparently all the, well, the Night King himself was immune to fire, so I'm guessing all the other White Walkers are too. So. Oh, all the dead people in the crypt. Oh no. Does it mean Ned's gonna wake up? Because his body, isn't his body like buried somewhere around here? And wasn't that the Maester Lewin? I don't know, I kind of look like them. I saw him for like half a second. <laughs> <laughs> no, this dragon's gonna. Danny, you gotta take off. You gotta take off. No. No, there's so many. No, this dragon's dead. This dragon's dead. Start flying! Why? Why are you just stand? Why are you just sitting there? No. Yeah, this dragon's dead. Danny's off the dragon. This dragon's dead. Oh, watch! It's it's gonna fly and then it's, it's gonna fall. Oh. Oh, uh, okay. Joy, let's go. Damn. Bran, what are you doing? No, he's out of arrows. 
bro. Theon's doing Theon's doing the most right now. Dude, Theon's trying as hard as he can to protect Bran. I love it. No, I just, don't kill yourself. I I mean, it would be probably a better death, but no, 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 no. Please don't, dude. <sighs> oh, okay, maybe not. Oh, uh, maybe mean maybe she might go out and fight. I don't know, because I mean that was a dragon glass blade, so. <laughs> Do you know what demoralizing that is to see that dragon right there do all that? It's so demoralizing to see them all just get up from the dead. Jora, Danny, yes, get him. Love the music and like the low pass on everything. Oh no! Pardon, Jamie. Nah, this is the part where we see everyone. No, Big B! Where we see everyone so close to dying, and then Brains is gonna pull through somehow and save us all. Okay, everyone's been like wounded, but no one's like dead yet. You know, like that's shown in the last like five minutes. You know, it wouldn't surprise me if the Night King just won and wiped out everyone. It wouldn't. That'd be a very Game of Thrones-esque ending. But there's still three more episodes, so like, I don't know about that one. You're a good man. <laughs> well, you're gonna die. Sniking skill. Thank you. Oh. Dude, is Bran about to die? Too? Like... The, uh, the end, you gotta at least stand up to the Night King. You know, don't be reek. You failed, Yara. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, maybe not just charge him. I don't know about that one. Like that. Oh. I knew that. I knew something like that was gonna happen. Damn. I can't get even a move, dog. Literally just went boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Three moves. <laughs> Damn. RIP Theon, though. RIP. I, I wish I wish Theon would have just tried to fight him like sword the sword, not try and charge him like that. But whatever. Okay, I guess he's not dead, alright. This music's like, um, season 6, episode 10, you know, not the exact same thing, but like, similar. You know some shit's about to happen, actually, because the same thing happened in that episode right before the entire thing blew up. Imagine Bran just stands up. <laughs> Bran should be like, you're shorter in person. Damn, is he about to kill Bran? Oh, fuck. Uh, oh. <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> Let's go. All the other White Walkers are blowing up now. Oh, okay. So he was the... Okay, so it was just him. <laughs> Waxed. Okay, so it was just that... It was just the Night King we had to kill then. I thought we had to take all the other... <coughs> Other White Walkers too. Damn, Arya, Arya's the one to fucking do it. Wow. Arya's the one. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, Joria. He's not so good. He's not so hot. We did it. <laughs> so that's why the Lord of Light wanted Arya to live. Jora, no.
No, even the dragon's sad about Jora. <laughs> What is she doing? She said she'd die, too. So, like, what? She about to die right here? Oh, she... Something about her necklace, huh? She's about to turn, like, an old woman or something. Maybe her purpose has been fulfilled, so now she can die or something. Because, yeah, we did win. We just defeated the Night King, yeah. Yep. So, Doe sees this. Oh, uh, yep, now she's old. Uh, don't get naked. Don't get, don't get. Oh, oh, she's. Oh, she just turned into a skeleton. Okay. Yeah. Shit. R.I.P. Damn. <sighs> well, that was episode three. <laughs> All right. Well, we lost a good amount of characters in this episode. Uh, that was a pretty good episode. I mean, that was a pretty good episode. I don't really have a problem with it, any of it. Well, there was like one thing I kind of noticed throughout it. Throughout it was they did this kind of a lot, and this like it kind of started to annoy me a little bit. But like, so like with Big B, Jora, Jamie, Sam, and like some of them, they would like it would show them getting swarmed, and then I'm like. I'm like anticipating, oh, they're about to die. You know, I'm like, this is it. They're gonna die right here. And then it just like cuts away. And I'm like, oh, okay, I guess not. But then they do it again. And I was like, oh no, okay, no, they're gonna die this time. And then it just cuts away. And I'm like, oh, I guess not. And then like, they just kept doing that. And I was like, dude, are they gonna fucking die or not? Like when Jora got wounded when he was with Danny, I was like, dude, is he gonna, like, I, I wasn't sure if he was gonna die or not, <laughs> but he, I actually, it never showed us, it never showed us if he's dead, actually. Like, the last thing, he was on the ground with Danny and the dragon, and then that's it. But I'm sure we'll find out in the next episode. But who died in this episode, dude? A lot. Okay, so we got, so Ed was like the first character to go. Lady Mormont. And then Theon. Yeah, who else was there, really? I'm sure others died, but like sig significant characters that I saw die. Yeah, those are like the significant characters. Oh, the Night King too, I guess. But those are like the significant characters that died. Oh, Beric. Beric died. Beric died. That's right. And Melisandre there, technically. Damn. I guess with Melisandre, like, her mission's over. Her job is done. Like, she fulfilled her her prophecy, I'd want to say. She's done serving the Lord of Light. Like, she was brought here to def help defeat the Night King, and we did it. So her her story is complete i i like that i'm not mad about that uh ed ed's death am i mad about that hmm. i don't know it was kind of like really sudden to be honest i mean they can't give every single character like a dramatic death so i i, I kind of get it i'm not too mad about that lady mormont i'm not gonna lie dude i am kind of mad about Eh, no because i guess like like when you think about it the smallest person well not like the smallest person but one of the smallest people there took out the biggest person there the giant i like that actually i like that but i thought that giant was just about to like squeeze her to death or like just press his thumb in her chest or like bite her head off okay i'm happy it didn't, that it didn't go that way i'm happy she killed a giant okay i'm happy she at least killed the giant i can i can live with that i'm i'm chill with that and you know what i realized too late okay so lady mormont is the girl in the last of us new series that's coming out and like i do plan on watching that i did plan on watching it before i realized this too but like i was i was looking at a poster of it and i was like oh we got pedro pascal on it that's lit and then i was like wait the girl looks so familiar and then i was like oh that's lady mormont that's gonna be so lit we got two game of thrones characters in it that's i love that Okay, I can't wait. I can't wait. It comes out. It comes out tomorrow. Well, it's past midnight right now, so it comes out Monday. Then Saturday. It's Friday as I'm recording this midnight. So it comes out Sunday. Then all right. Damn. All right. I'm definitely doing that. I'm definitely doing that series. And then we got Theon's death. <sighs> Theon, dude. I am very satisfied with his death. I feel like the moment was really good. Bran, he was accepted by Bran and everything. You're a good man, you know? It's all Theon wanted was just to be accepted. 
I'm happy with that. I don't like how he just charged the Night King the way he with the spear. I'm not really a fan of that. I would have loved it if like maybe he stood his ground and the Night King like walked up to him and then they had like a sword fight and then he lost that way. I mean, actually, I kind of like him going towards the Night King though, like charging him because if he kind of stood there waiting for him, it would resemble a reek a little bit still. But the fact that he charged the Night King means that he completely disattached from the identity of reek i feel like so okay actually i'm not too mad about that maybe maybe just give him a sword instead of a spear i don't know i feel like the spear the spear is just like weird but yeah aria and then aria was the one to kill the night king she was the one to kill him and so Beric, you know, he 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 always said like the lord of light has kept me alive for a reason you know and then when he find when he died it was like okay well his purpose was to save aria you know and i was like Okay, so what's special about Arya? And, and Arya is the one to kill the Night King. That's what it was. And Melisandre realized that too, so maybe not exactly what it was, but okay, no. The Lord of Light had Beric save you right there for a reason, so we, you know, we'll get to it. <laughs> so I love that. I mean, like, think about how, like, demoralizing it is for everyone. Like, they, they, they're almost done. Like, they're not, like, almost done, but they got through so many of them, and then they all just come back to life. When the Night King, like, did this to John, I'm like, come on, bro. Like, <laughs> that's so demoralizing. Okay, actually, this is something I didn't know. Like, I'm not sure about. So, like, the Whites that are already dead, once we kill them, can they just come back to life, too? Or is it already people who were, like, alive, then died, who can come back as a White, if that makes sense? Like, once you, if you're a white and then you get slain again, can you just come back? Because then his army's just infinite, no matter what. His army is already infinite, technically, because the soldiers on your side that die, he'll just bring, he'll just, you know, resurrect them, make them in the whites, so his army just keeps growing. But his soldiers that are already whites that die, can they come back? I don't know. But yeah, I thought it was all the White Walkers that needed to die. And not just the Night King himself, but okay, I mean, he's the king, I guess, so that makes sense. But yeah, this is a hell of a battle. This was a hell of a battle. You know what, you know what's surprising? You know what's actually really surprising? I am shocked that Sam survived. <laughs> like, I feel like there was a couple moments where, you know, he should have died. He should have died, but the camera cut away, so he got saved. <laughs> and I'm not gonna lie, I almost, I was about to start crying when Theon died, like, it, it was very emotional like it definitely hit it definitely hit for me and my eyes did my eyes did start the water but then it cut away so then i was like so then it kind of like took my mind off of it so but yeah that was game of thrones season eight episode three comment down below what you thought about this episode down below in the comments and if you liked the video like the video and thanks for watching hey you know what this means we fucking won we're gonna go kill Cersei now. We're gonna go kill her ass, cause she betrayed us.